Welcome everybody to another episode of Dynasty Warriors 3 Jia Haldun's mission mode. We're going to be doing the battle of Jia Ting in this episode. We must defeat Zhuge Liang and cannot let Sima Yi get defeated, but that's going to be easy. You see there's barely any enemy officers in the field, likewise we barely have any officers ourselves. Uh, we have got more Macha Wei An to deal with, but that's fine, we've got this. Here's the introduction. Thanks to the efforts of Zhang Liao, Cao Cao emerges victorious against the Wu forces at Hefei. Suffering heavy losses, the Wu army is destroyed, taking the Wei Empire to even greater heights of power. In response to Wei's expansion, Zhuge Leon leads the Shu army to battle. Wei, with their forces to the west and commander Cao Zhen defeated, promotes Sima Yi to the rank of general commander. Setting out immediately, Sima Yi confronts Zhuge Leon at Qishan, and in 228, presses towards Shu strongpoint in Hanzong, Jating. Protecting Jating was Zhuge Leon's beloved pupil, Ma Su. Okay, so let's jump right into this bad boy. Not gonna be a very long battle, we've got this. It's all about finding Shu's supply depot. You report from the spies! The, the main Shu force has definitely camped! So, was the enemy camp pretty? What? Um, it, it was normal, I suppose! People! We must destroy their formation with a beautiful one of our own. This is the art of battle. Now, you will see. We shall take the shoe supply depot and cut their feet out from under them. All units, break through the enemy defenses and find the supply depot. General Zhang He, take the enemy leader. Okay, this is what I do best. I defeated an officer. Now, really, the only way to really get to the Shu Supply Depot is to take out Masu's unit at the summit. Because you can get to the Supply Depot and nothing will happen, as I find out in this video. And there's Wei An. You were! Yet to play as Wei An. We've yet to play him. He's a new character to the series. Um, so we can, you need, we need to take out Masu, but I didn't know, really know this in this, when playing this, uh, level at this time. So we don't do it, but that's how you want to quickly get to the Supply Depot. For now though, let's take out Wei An. I'm pretty sure another officer just turned up to support Wei An, but... Yep, there's Li An, he's here to support him. But we've already taken care of Gao Jiang, so... This is going very well. If we can take out Li An... Wei An's not too much of it. Oh, he's gonna heal. Is he gonna heal? No, he didn't take the opportunity to heal. I am very surprised. I defeated an officer. Okay, so that's that done. Now, just Wei An. Hit him with his true Mushu attack. Nearly. Blood destroyed his um destroyed destroyed his um guard there. He's past the stars. Individual dueling with officers isn't that bad. In Dynasty Warriors 4 there's actually a feature that you can actually individually duel with officers sometimes occasionally. Which is very interesting. Now here's the Mushu Wine location. Kind of pretty much right next to where Wei-Yan is. We shall attack Zhang Yi and all of his men. Okay, Chen Shi. As you can see, Masu is actually attacking um, Zhang Yi, and they will actually beat him and you're, if you're playing his way. An officer. But... Here's the dim sum right next to Masu, so we're going to go and take care of Masu here as well. I'm going to take care of him, and then we're going to charge in the mountain towards the supply depot. Still an enemy force, Jiang Wei I believe, on the right hand side of the map, but I'm not too worried about it. This guy, Masu, is actually, he's got quite high morale, so you got to watch out for that, but he's going down quite well. 
Not too worried about this. And he's, it wasn't even me that took him down, it was my bodyguards, but he's down. That's all that matters. Now, here is why I'm paying at one of the offices on the Zhigui Island. The, the, the supply depot is to the left of my current position. And this, see there, those little wooden tower things? That's the supply depot. Um, so we can go in there, like, right now. Look, we're going to go in there. We found it. Look, it's there. But it doesn't do anything. We need to wait until Zhang He has defeated Master's troops and set himself up in the mountain to charge down from the mountain. It's annoying, but that's how this battle really works, is that Zhang He has to be the one to do it. If you're playing as Zhang He, it's a lot easier, but if you're not, then look. A downhill charge like falling blossoms. My people, let's dance around them. And there you go, there's the charge. They're going to downhill attack. It's a bit late for them to do that here. I'm fighting Zhu Liang right now, but... Hey, if you're going to do it, you're going to do it. Go for it, right? Let's try and take out this gate. I don't really want officers, like, people pouring in. And I wanted to show this off. This is this cutscene that happens once Zhang here charges down the hill. As you see, the shoe supply depot is now being destroyed now that they've charged down the hill. Take the uh, but it did require Zhang He getting down there for that to happen. And Zhao Yun has appeared as reinforcements. But I'm not too worried about He has got really high morale, though. Maybe I should be worried about that. But as long as we can take out Zhuge Liang, we should be fine. Zhuge Liang's morale is dropping down to 2. So that's quite good, but as long as... Xiao Yun doesn't interfere. We should be okay. And there's a little slight audio issue that I have just noticed. There's a little bit of sinking audio. Sorry about that. I apologize. Not sure why that happened. Hopefully it's a one-off. Although I have been experiencing a lot of audio glitches in my other playthroughs as well sometimes. Right, as you can see, Zhuge Liang is the commander, so his health is going to go down at a very slow rate, which is very frustrating. Don't fall behind. Well, we're going to hopefully wear him down. Zhang Wei has been taken, Ma Chao has been taken care of by ZNG. So we don't have to worry about them anymore, just Zhao Yun. But Zhao Yun is hopefully a little bit far away that he's not going to get involved. Oh, look, come on. It's down to that second name. Well, the first name, actually. Zhuge has his... Zhuge is actually his second name. Liang is his first. And he's down. There will be another day. There will be another day, and I'll kick your ass then as well. And that's that. Battle of Jiating is complete. Now, have a wee quick replay. 9 minutes 8 seconds. Got a current sword, a great scimitar. Well, well, that's fine. Yeah, not really bothered. If it's not a current sword, I don't care about it really at this point. Now, next episode. Wonder what we'll have. I predict it's going to be the Battle of Wujang Plains. Predict, anyway. Yeah, it is. There we go. What do you know? I was right. Zhu Geilian is getting worried. He's trying to speed things up. The last twinkle of a dying flame is beautiful. Shall he die beautifully? We shall smother the flames of war and bring peace. Then, we can say that we have perfected the art of war. Today, Shu dies! Attack! And that is that. The cinematic. Okay, so... Thanks for watching, and join me next time when we take on this battle. See you then.